Ferrero, a four euro of count. How do I say a four euro? A four euro, okay. For those of you, if I can say where it's a Yoruba word and I'm not Yoruba, so please, please just correct me, you know. <laughs> you can correct me. I know it's a four euro, yeah. I don't know if I'm really pronouncing it well, but it's spinach stew. That's what I'm making, so I love it. That's my We are going to be making it together. Who's ready to cook with me, yeah? Are you ready to come and cook with me and for it all with me? It's spinach stew, it's very yummy. Uh, you can eat it with yam, you can eat it with rice, you can eat it with pandyam, but uh, in particular, I like eating it with pandyam. I only eat my favorite with pandyam, that's what I'm used to eating it with. But you can eat it with different things, trust me. So stay tuned and we are getting it started now. Let's go. Guys, so I'm just gonna wash um, my spinach. So they're quite fresh so when i make my ferrero quite like making it with fresh spinach do not like the frozen one well. so i'm just gonna start washing her and be sure each time you're doing your ferrero that your spinach is very clean because sometimes you do release really sand in the middle so i pick everything up one by one to wash so let's see this i wash this and i wash that that's how i clean my guys as you can see i'm just calling my spinach um i like using fresh spinach a lot but as you can see i'm not following any rules here oh it has to be small it has to be big it has to be medium i'm just calling it any size I'm using a uh, turkey, chucky and fish for my if we will. Got my tomatoes here that I need for my spinach stew. Guys, this is my scotch bonnet. I've got my Maggi cubes and my salt. Got palm oil. I'm just gonna start making my ferrero now as you can see i'm just putting my palm oil into my cookware as you can see it has to be really light once it's light then i can actually add onions as you can see i'm adding onions to it it's looking already beautiful you know just adding my scotch bonnet now as you can see and after that i'm gonna be adding my tomatoes so uh, i'm using public tomatoes guys i love public in my tomatoes so i don't have to cook it that much before making my food so look how beautiful and yummy this looks already so after this i'm just gonna add all the ingredients to it for example i'm adding my maggie cubes now and i'm gonna add my salt and after that i will just stir and stir everything together and after that i'm adding my fish turkey and shaki to my food look at it look at it guys. look how beautiful look how yummy look how delicious this look already and it's not finished yet let's go to the final part guys so i'm just gonna 
start adding my crayfish by the way i forgot to add my crayfish a bit earlier so i'm just adding it and that i remember and i'm adding my spinach to it as you can see the spinach is looking beautiful at this stage i'll just turn off my cooker because i use electrical uh cooker so the electrical cooker will stay here a bit after a few minutes we'll be back to check on our f 4 rear. Guys, look, my F4 Vero is ready. It's ready, it's ready. It's looking yummy, it's looking greenish, it's looking everything, guys. Whatever you want to call it, it's looking. It's like looking delicious, it's looking delirious, it's looking whatever. Whatever name you want to give it, this is looking really yummy, guys. Trust me, you need to try this recipe. And please, if you try my recipe, always comment and tell me how it tastes and how it came. This is where we're ending it today. Thank you so much for watching me make my favorite or my spinach stew. So thank you so much. I really appreciate you watching. Please don't forget to press that button for me when you subscribe, that notification button. Don't forget to touch it. It's very important. So please subscribe comment below and i will really appreciate you for doing that please please guys don't forget to share my video tell your friends and family to come and subscribe uh, uh, we are gonna do this together we are family you know that we are family thank you and i will see you back next time bye bye <laughs>